Hello, my name is Kiana, and for my digital artifact through the form of a podcast, I will be exploring whether or not cyberbullying and online harassment is prevalent throughout online and multiplayer gaming. Cyberbullying is bullying that is done through the use of technology. However, cyberbullying attacks also occur in online multiplayer gaming and or through connected devices such as Xbox Live. Cyberbullying has transformed into such a widespread complication and has progressed over time that it has become extremely unhealthy, dangerous and damaging. The prevalence is so great that the sheer amount of public backlash is reason enough to assume every gamer has experienced cyberbullying at least once in their life. Some gamers think it's okay to send harassing messages to their opponents in online gaming world. After all, it's not real life, it's just a game. However, bullying through online gaming can be more than just people who play video games for the sheer satisfaction of harassing other players. It could be reflected through online hacking, viruses, and trolling. In fact, a large percentage of female gamers have been sexually harassed in digital environments, such as being asked to perform virtual sex behaviors in return for in-game currencies. Throughout this digital artifact, I aim to explore deeper into why gamers spread bullying through an entertainment-based luxury like gaming, and how it affects the player receiving the negative criticism, as well as what gaming brands and communities are doing to resolve or minimize the issue. Within one of the podcasts, I'll be discussing a part of the topic with a person I know who has been on the receiving side of bullying through online and multiplayer gaming, where I'll be able to gather first-hand information, some of which will be in the form of discussion, other in which it will be an interview-like style. It will then allow me to connect with the listeners who have experienced the same thing, as well as understanding it on a deeper, more personal level. After the first podcast has been recorded and released, I'll be engaging with my audience by posting a survey online, through Facebook and Instagram, about topics relevant to the podcast. This would then not only provide engagement, but rather feedback and data as well. In addition to that, I will be posting a few subreddits to engage with different audiences on another large-scale media platform. Thank you.